on my back to GIMP. Someone asked me how you can set the units in grids. So the usual method that I've shown in one of my videos where I talked about creating grids is to create a new layer and then you go to filters, render, pattern and there's an option for rendering grids. Problem here is that it's always set to points. So if I change, for example, the unit down here to millimeters, you can see it's relatively hard to find the right spot here because it's always set to points. So if you need your grid, for example, in millimeters, I would advise you to go to image and then configure your default grid. Usually it's black by default. And here you can set your units. Let me use millimeters and adjust it. Vertical and horizontal are linked and you can see how the pixel value is automatically calculated by the system. Let me make that maybe blue. As I've said by default, it's black. I confirm and now if I go to view, show grid, you can see it's blue. And if I set this to millimeters, we have our exact value. Right here, 10 for horizontal and vertical. Let us once more do that. We'll go to image, configure grid. And if I change this to, let's say 25, you can see how this automatically gets adjusted. So instead of rendering it, once again, go to image, use the configure grid option right here, and then you should be good. Once you've got that done, you want to go to view and check snap to grid, because usually you now want to have your tools snap to the grid that you've created. And now, for example, use the rectangular marquee tool, you can see how this snaps into these cells. Hope that answered your question. If not, let me know in the comments below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.